correspondence in a bottle, eh? Ahoy, Eugene. I'm so proud you followed your old grandpa's peg leg and became a pirate that I'll be sailing by for a ship's inspection. That vessel better be well oiled or you'll be dancing the short plank jig. I'll be looting Grandpa Redbeard. Grandpa Redbeard, come here, Papa, you did this right now. I didn't know your grandpa was a pirate, Mr. Krabs. I they come from a whole family of pirates. Gramps used to say, the Krabs clan has been pirates for as long as we've had claws. And he wanted me to be a pirate, too. One day you'll be a plundering pirate just like your old granddad here. <laughs> so I bought me a ship, hired a crew, Arr! and for years I drifted the high seas as a pirate. And booty did abound. I started to notice a recurrent theme. I just wasn't turning enough profit. So I fired me crew and sold me ship. It was also the last time I saw me granddad. Arr, if it ain't me pirate grandson. Well, actually, Grandpa, I just sold... You know how proud it makes me to see the only grandson continuing in the family business. <laughs> yeah, Grandpa, hey. And I'll be keeping me eye on your career to see how you progress. Just remember, the only rule in the Pirate's Code of Honor is never tell a lie. <laughs> For all he knows... The Krusty Krab is a pirate ship. If he were to find out the truth, it'd break his salty barnacle encrusted heart. <laughs> Why don't we just make the Krusty Krab look like a pirate ship? Hmm, not a bad idea, boy. But we're gonna need a first-rate crew. We've got Squidward, and I could get Patrick to join up. Yeah. <laughs> 